Dallas news of the last minute. Surprisingly, our reporters got this valuable information. But before we get into the news, I'd like to make a request. Subscribe to the channel so we can soon surpass the number of subscribers of Eagles. Together, we will conquer the rank of the main news channel. Micah Parsons is said to be among the key figures shaping the outcome of the impending clash between the Dallas Cowboys and the San Francisco 49ers. These two teams are scheduled to face off in a primetime showdown in Santa Clara, and the game is poised to send a resounding message about both franchises throughout the course of four quarters. The two-time first-team All-Pro pass rusher, while not registering a sack in the 38-3 demolition of the New England Patriots, managed to exert significant pressure on the quarterback, tallying eight quarterback pressures. This pressure played a crucial role in keeping Mac Jones uncomfortable throughout the game. However, Parsons did sustain injuries to his knee and ankle by the end of the contest. Moment of interruption in the news report to present a notice of importance. We would like to point out that if you wish to continue to be recommended by YouTube to receive the latest news, it is essential that you leave your mark of support by clicking the like button on this video. We express our gratitude in advance. We now return you to the new sequence. Nonetheless, he asserts that he's fully prepared for this weekend's matchup. After undergoing treatment and the additional preparation I've put in for this game, I genuinely feel fantastic and highly motivated at the moment, Parsons stated. This is excellent news for the Cowboys, especially considering that Parsons will often find himself lined up against one of the NFL's premier left tackles, Trent Williams, who is arguably the best in the league. Williams recently described games against Dallas as physically demanding. Parsons concurs, stating, absolutely. It's always a hard-fought battle. These matchups consistently turn into grueling contests. I believe they give us their all, more so than any other opponent. I definitely anticipate that this will be one of those games. I embrace it. As he contemplates the upcoming Sunday clash, Parsons reveals that he's operating in a distinct mindset this week. I've been locked into my zone all week, Parsons affirmed. I feel great. I'm prepared to engage in battle right now. I make an effort to maintain my mindset, particularly for games like this one because of the significance it holds for both sides. It's the Cowboys versus the 49ers. There's nothing quite like it. A significant factor in the impending battle will be the Cowboys' ability to generate turnovers in contrast to the 49ers' offense, which has been cautious with the football in their first four games of the 2023 season. Brock Purdy has yet to throw an interception and has lost possession only once via fumble, although he has fumbled the ball four times. Parsons sees these situations as opportunities for potential takeaways, emphasizing that the Cowboys must capitalize on such chances. This contest represents the meeting of an unstoppable force and an immovable object in a gritty showdown between two of the NFC's finest teams. Both are determined to make a statement within the conference as they kick off the second quarter of the season. As the saying goes, something has to give, Parsons remarked. Indeed, something will inevitably give in this high-stakes showdown. What's up, fans? How are you interpreting this news? Do you feel an agreement or do you have a dissenting perspective? Leave your analysis in the comments area. This feedback is of great importance for our beloved team to understand your opinion. Stay tuned, as I will be back with more information at any moment.